Hi, it's Ashley from AB Sound Advice. Today we're doing a product review on the Pathos Converto Mark II DAC headphone amplifier. And I have to say, wow, this is absolutely amazing. I've really enjoyed playing with this. I've had it for quite a while now. And as you would have heard in my some of my headphone amplifier reviews, I mentioned about digital sound and um, how I like using RCA to USB connection and the digital side can be just a little bit uh, you know can be just quite uh, metallic and quite um, harsh and here we are and you've got to take your hat off to our friends at uh, Pathos because the Converto uh, Mark II wow what an amazing synergy between the DAC and the amp combo built into this. It really is sensational. So here's a situation where we are using the built-in DAC and using the digital input, and we've got this very smooth and, again, high-fidelity sound um, that's just truly amazing. It really, again, hats off to uh, Pathos. I mean, this is a fantastic DAC amplifier. Now, as always, we'll go through the specs um, with you, um, we might as well just have a quick look at that now actually. So we'll start off, it is a um, obviously digital input sample rate, 32-bit through 384KHZ. USB, you've got um, analog stage fully balanced, class A, zero feedback. We've got a uh, dynamic range of uh, 120 dB, a signal to a signal noise ratio of 110 dB, total distortion at 0.01%, analog line output, uh, one time balanced XLR and one times RCA, uh, RCA sorry. So output impedance um, up to 30 ohm. We have a fixed output level of 3.2 volt RMS and a variable output of 0 through to 6.3 volt RMS. And inputs, we've got two USB-B and we have two, uh, sorry, one, um, so what we, uh, sorry, I'm just trying to go on blank, coaxial um, input. And we also have a um, fiber optic, a pair of RCA um, inputs. We also, um, on here, we have a output level of 7 volt RMS, which is pretty impressive, and a power consumption of 10 volts and we also have a specifications of, and this is all in inches, unfortunately, 7.87 7 inches by 8.9 inches by 2.75 millimeter. Um, okay, that's an interesting way of doing it. So we've got a combination of inches and millimeters. <laughs> so you'll need to confirm that on the actual um, Pathos site. Weight, we're coming in at 2.5 kgs or 5.5 pounds. So. Without further ado, what comes in the box, we also just, again, there's the owner's manual and the user manual, sorry. And what we'll do is we'll just go around the back and give you a look. So you can see here in the back of the unit, as I was saying before, we have um, a some a, some XLR outputs. And you've also uh, can have a switch where you can use fixed or variable. We also have, obviously, RCA input. There's your coaxial You've got your optical, and again, the two computer input, digital inputs, one and two. And I think that's fantastic, having the options to do both. And you can see my test cables that I've got plugged into the back. So let's have a look. So from the standpoint here, we do have a really, really nice setup. I mean, as you would have remembered on the headphone amp, we had the red and the um, the little buttons there were red as well. This unit here comes in a black and silver, so that option is uh, not available in this particular model. But in, in reality, um, obviously this is the black version, it looks fantastic. You can see I've still got my headphone cable still plugged in, and I've got a adapter converting that into from into a balance cable. I played a whole stack of different headphones, and again using the reference O Bravo's um, Hammett um, Mark uh, one Mark two, and they are fantastic. I mean, really enjoyed this. I mean, from a musical perspective, uh, it really is 
it, the way it's managing the digital side actually really surprised me. I guess it's like looking at low-res digital photos versus high-res digital photos. You know, both of them will probably look okay, uh, but it's just got that attention to detail, and it really is a high-fidelity headphone DAC amp. I mean, I'm really, really not wanting to give this back. It is a unit that um, I've had for a while, and it's set here in a situation where it's a... I really don't want it to leave. This is really a fantastic <laughs> headphone amp, and I really have enjoyed it. It really, all the different connections, iPhone, you can see on the back there, I pretty well um, tested all the the inputs and outputs, and I actually did run this as a DAC through the um, Pathos headphone amplifier as well, using the XLR um, outs and ins. And I think as I review this, I'm thinking to myself, I actually really... If I'm going to make a call here, I'd probably go with the Converto Mark II um, just because it's just all in one. It is a fantastic headphone DAC. And again, made in Italy, so handmade. So each one is made um, to the highest standard. And as you said, it's got the DA Converter preamplifier headphone amp. And I guess the other thing that I would say is from a musical standpoint, it's depth and clarity um, the high fidelity, the, the music, just the whole way it manages the whole thing. Um, very enjoyable. And it didn't matter what I put through this or what headphones I plugged into this. It was just sensational. And I guess the other thing we should cover off in this part of the world is just about the 5K mark for one of these. And when you think about it, that's not bad considering you get the DAC amp all in one. And it is Italian quality. There is no argument. It, it, it's to a very high superior level of um, the build quality of this. Sound quality um, definitely be right up there in the top top five for me that I've had in my office. And if you'd like to find out more information about the Pathos Converto uh, Mark II, you can duck onto hifihq.co.nz for New Zealand or hifihq.com.au for Australia. Or just duck onto the pathosacoustics.com um, and you'll find all the information there. So, as I've stated in many of my reviews, uh, I don't rate things 1 to 5 or 1 to 10. Would I own this? Absolutely. Um, this is really a, it's a unit that's very hard to give back. I've got to say, I've thoroughly enjoyed it. The other thing I'll mention too about the volume control, instead of it, it's not, it's not a turning one. You just tap it to go up, tap it to go down. Um, it lights up in the background. You hit this button here for your inputs, and I've got all the different inputs connected. You can hear the clicking as it moves between the different inputs. And I guess from my perspective, uh, it, it, it just ticks all the boxes off for me. It really is, I'm really going to miss this um, when it goes back. And um, if you're looking for a high fidelity, high quality headphone amp that'll play pretty well anything and again the other thing I liked about this too going back to that digital DAC input it's providing that you know turntable analog sound in a digital way that's really enjoyable so it's it's softening off it's not so harsh and I, and, and I guess when you're playing at this level um, they are actually able to adjust this unit um, to provide all the fruit and the clarity and and it's just so full it's just a fantastic item um, in the way when you when you look at the sound. And again, I'll um, you look at my screen here. You'll see um, this is the my headphone playlist that I've been using, and I use that pretty well on all my high end stuff. And it really is addictive. It's very once you start listening, it's very hard to um, to stop playing music. You end up hours just listening. It really is addictive. So I hope you've enjoyed today's product review on the Converto. Um, Mark II from Pathos and I really if you're looking for a, a DAC headphone amplifier and you, you, you're happy to part with 5k um, this you would not be disappointed with and of course these prices vary depending on where you live but uh, this really is a fantastic item so again thank you for tuning into AP Sound Advice and we'll see you next time